doves know their way to their earthly home. She also knew her way to her heavenly home. The psalmist said, oh, if I had the wings of a dove, I will fly away and be at rest. The first releasing of the doves. I don't know if y'all can see it, but do y'all see that heart in the sky? Y'all see that heart? Oh my God. I love you, Jada. You will always and forever be in my heart. That is so beautiful. But yeah, let's get to it. So I woke up this morning. I was kind of sluggish a little bit. Um, I don't know. I guess the weather changed and it felt like a little colder in the house. But I got up and um, and I got myself together. It took me a minute because my hair is a fool. I wanted to be at the house by 730 to work out. So at least do me two miles and head to the gym. But it didn't work like that. But your girl still got it in. Um... I had some new ideas in mind for me with Foxy Fox Fitness. Um, Sweat Fest is like the number one popular workout routine with Foxy Fox Fitness. And I just wanted to add some new uh, routines, some equipment with it. And I'm telling y'all, I definitely, definitely think it's going to be a hit. No, I don't think I know it's going to be a hit. And it's going to it's gonna definitely give what it needs to give to the body. Okay? But um, I am bringing back virtual i'm definitely trying to get myself back on track i feel so damn good like i feel amazing um and i'm just blessed you know i'm blessed forever jada strong never forget that she will always be in my heart and um yeah i'm about to pull up at Publix because we need some water and 
what else we need i don't know i'll look at my my notes when i get done talking to y'all but i'm sweaty i don't like to have the air on when i get done working out i like to feel the heat in the car i've been like that since i started working out i don't like to leave the gym and i'm sweaty and then get in the car and turn on the air i just like to be in the heat i always take it home then you know i take a shower all bad and above but i'm super excited i get to see my foxy ladies tonight i have not seen them y'all in two whole weeks it's been two weeks since i've seen them yes they have been holding themselves accountable since i have not been there and i'm forever grateful for that that just goes to show me pat on the back that you know i i pour into my ladies enough for them to believe in themselves even when i'm not around and i'm just so thankful for them i'm thankful for the encouragement words since i've been going through this process i'm thankful for everybody that's been in my my corner um supporting me while i'm taking a break so understanding and not being like i need to work out she getting on my nerves blage blage just really supporting and understanding that i needed a break and i needed time to myself but your girl is back and i'm ready to work and you know god told me to get up he told me to get moving don't stop doing what you're doing apply a little bit more pressure because you've been sleep on yourself you got goals you got dreams you got things that you want to bring to reality and you can't do that by sitting down on your ass get up so this is from me to you. If you are in a dark place, if you feel like procrastination is taking over your mind, if you feel like that you don't know where you need to be at in your life and you're confused, stop what you're doing and take a look at the people around you. Stop what you're doing. Get on your knees. Pray. Stop what you're doing and make sure that's something that you wanted to do. Make sure your passion is into it. You love doing it. Um, and don't let people bring you down. So just journal a lot. Get your journal out. Pay attention to how you feel. Certain things that you eat, does it make you sluggish? Does it make you mentally tired, drained? You don't have, you know, you don't have any energy. Pay attention to everything that you do because your body is your temple. Like I said in my last vlog, treat it with the most of high respect. You only get one body. You only live one time. So I don't know if this is the wake up call from me to you, but get your ass up. Get out of that dark place keep praying keep praying keep praying keep doing the work keep healing keep learning yourself keep working on trying to become a better you and i promise you will soon see glory you will soon i was about to say see lightness but you will soon see the glory out of everything that you have been going through and don't for a second think that what you're going through is meant to bring you down it's really meant to bring you up it's it's for you to have a reality check and it's for you to see how much you can grow through all the hurt and pain that you have been through and what you're gonna do with that afterwards you know what i'm saying so yeah i'll see y'all later hey y'all good morning my hair is so thick i said good morning because it's morning it's seven 7 50 and i'm up because i can't do anything just with my hair i don't get my hair done till wednesday and we go out of town friday and this is a mess like my hair is a hot mess do you see i don't blue dry this i haven't blue dry this i don't blue dry this and it's just so thick So y'all, I had left this part down because 
that part won't go. Um, I'm gonna get on my nerves leaving his boo boo bags in front of the garage. Like that, get on my nerves. She know better than that. And that ball need to get out of my. Hold on. Okay, y'all. I'm back. I'm back. Your girl. I tried to let the part down in the bag hang. I flat ironed a little bit because it's so thick and it was so full. But that didn't work neither. So guess what? I had to put it up, clip it up in the back, and just made it do what it do. I called Kiyosha and told her, I'm about to cut this shit off. I'm about to cut this off. I don't want to deal with it. I don't want to do it. I don't want to think about it. I don't want to sit in no chair. I just don't know. But the ball is balling. Look, I got this on my camera. The ball is balling. But y'all, listen. <laughs> I hate doing my hair. I'm on my way to the gym to train. I got up early this morning to go do me two miles before I train. And guess what? My hair flat on this side, standing up on this side. Ew. Oh my God, I got the one with zero sugar. This is disgusting. I'm gonna drink it cause I spent my money. Oh, I don't even wanna talk no more, y'all. Me some breakfast, so that's what I want. And we be baby, perfect twin. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. Hey, bye, bye. Go on, bye. Go. Ain't nothing up here for you. I'm about to make me. I don't know if I want turkey bacon, but. I got me some turkey bacon out, some eggs, they almost gone, some avocados, some onions, some spinach. Yeah, let's get into it. I was there when I needed someone who wasn't getting over you. When I move to the side, when I move on your mind, and I know what you're feeling, I'ma take you for a ride. Take it off your mind, cause you know it's a season And I move, and I move, and I move when I ride And I move, and I move, and I move when I ride And I move, and I move, and I move when I ride And I move, and I move when I, yeah I get so tired of making me take a night But taking is all that I do, cause it is I let you show, don't let you in on my life I tell you the things that you need to know
So, y'all, I burnt my spinach a little bit, but, so, and it still was good. Yes, I put this omelet that's fully loaded with all the vegetables that you need and a little bit of cheese. I had to go get the guacamole. Well, not guacamole. I'm sorry. Avocado. Cut that bad boy open. Mm, 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 mm. Who don't love them a good avocado? Come on now. If you don't like avocado, something wrong. But yeah, cut that bad boy open. Grab my spoon. Scoop that out. Made sure I got all of it because I wanted every bit of what was inside of this what outside surface. Cut that, cut it up in half. And guess what I'm about to do? I'm about to slap that thing on top of that omelet. It ain't got to be all fancy and neat, honey. Okay? Add your little sour cream just a little bit. A little bit more drops and then you done. And... Baby, let me taste this. Let me show y'all the avocado one more time. Because y'all sleep. Y'all need to y'all need to like avocado. Mmm. Chewing it, getting that taste. Then you know when you start dancing, it's good. When you start dancing, it's good. Do you hear me? And then you got the soda with it. <laughs> y'all, I can't put this at the class. And look who in here. Look. Mama. <laughs> Jay in here at the class. Place was good tonight to y'all. Place was great tonight. We played cards tonight and they did their thing tonight. And they said they was mad at me. Tasha was really mad at me. She said I'm full of shit because sweat fest done baby fired them. I should have been doing Baby. We didn't do sweat fest. We played cards today. And we play cards. One week ago. I'm about to go. I haven't decided yet, actually. Italy came fourth when I was discarded by Team USA in high school. But in the meanwhile, many things have happened. Now the situation is different. Uh oh. So with that down on the table, Team USA jumped in. He's one of those players that we're following for the World Cup. So today I had hair to do and some of y'all in the comments been wanting to see me do hair so I remembered to record while I was doing her hair and it didn't take me long. She got medium butt length not less and she got great texture of hair so it really didn't take me that long. It took me like four and a half hours but here y'all go.
<laughs> Good night, y'all. Thank you for subscribing to my channel. I'm going to bed. I had a long day and I got a long weekend ahead of me. Stay tuned for this weekend.